can't see in the dark. Yeah. Welcome. Oh, are we filming? <laughs> <laughs> What's up, everybody? Welcome to the Dickie Dine Show. Today Super we are playing Super Fight. Super Fight. So, so, so you, there's two characters. It's like a versus game. So you flip over two of each card, and the white one is like one a, of a person, card. basically, and then the other two things are like an ability or a hindrance, and uh, you have to argue uh, on who would win between the two fighting. Okay. So like. I.E., we have pick a movie character. So, should I go? Yeah, go for okay. it. Okay. Uh, Clint Eastwood. <laughs> no, yeah, so, character. So, so does, no, it's Clint Eastwood. So, Clint Eastwood, <laughs> armed with an axe and armed with a sadness ray, versus a sumo wrestler that. Wait, draw a character card as your 500 pound pet. Sumo okay. wrestler with a, with a men, 500 pound <laughs> men in black pet. I don't get it. <laughs> He's got Will Smith, 500 yeah. pounds, as a sidekick. Okay. That, <laughs> leeches, clean, clean that leeches, leeches opponent's health when touched. Damn it. Well, okay, that seems pretty That's two really fat people. Yeah, well, yeah. dude, aren't so a lot of sadness range? They're, they're probably sad. They're both pretty fat. You could just amplify that sadness, make them end, the, end it. They'll but be so they, depressed they, be, they can't even move. But wouldn't they be so sad that they want to hug, and then they hug you and leech all your health away? But then Clint Eastwood with an axe. Well, I, yeah, he's an old man, though, so like, I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm leaning more towards the ray on his side. I don't think the axe is going to do much for him. Gotcha. Especially since if he gets touched, he gets his health leech, and yeah. he's got, like, one health left. I'm going to go with sumo wrestlers. I'm mm -hmm. going to go with these guys, because... I think you're underestimating the power of that sadness ray. <laughs> you don't know how sad it gets, and you, we don't even know that... Okay, both these guys are severely overweight. Yeah, I mean, so they're already sad. Away. How much more sad? Can well, that's you what I'm saying. They're they're so close to the sadness that they might just off themselves and never fight. <laughs> I don't think with. so. Because super wrestlers are like they're also like oh, the most respected, respected okay, but men in black athletes in their country. Yeah, and they're fucking really, really pound for pound like some of the strongest. Well, yeah, but if you take away that pride by will. making them sad. Yeah, if you take all the way away all their rage. Uh, we need a spe specificity on how sad this ray can make people. Yeah. We need some fucking like so sad. Like, does it change your mood so like they won't even want to fight because they're just sad now? They're not even like angry or hyped. Yeah, maybe. And Clint Eastwood made him so sad that they didn't want to fight him anymore. Yeah. All right, let's do it. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm voting for Clint Eastwood on that one. Let's move on. Do you feel <laughs> sad? That was just an example. <laughs> that was just the example. He's got like the notebook in his hand. So let's play. You ready, Austin? Go first. Go for go for. So we got identical twins with agoraphobic. And three stories tall. So, <laughs> so agoraphobic, <laughs> identical twins that, that are three that stories can't go tall. Outside because they're agoraphobic. But where do they live if they're three stories tall? In, In a, a four-story four building. building. <laughs> <laughs> so they're, yeah, there's twins, and they're in a <laughs> four-story tall building that's All right, two what, twins wide. What's the second one? And they're fighting 101 Dalmatians. <laughs> Wearing one of those cones they put on <laughs> to keep them from licking themselves. <laughs> so 101 useless use Dalmatians. Uh, steal one attribute from opponent. Discard, discard after use. They're three stories um, tall. Oh god. So now all you have is an agoraphobic. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no. So now. It's huge, 101 huge puppies <laughs> that can't lick themselves. <laughs> Versus identical twins that are agoraphobic. <laughs> this is pretty easy. Unfortunate yeah. identical twins. Yeah, the Dalmatian <laughs> twin. The three-story Dalmatians for sure. Dude, that sucks for the twins. Man. <laughs> they got they real. got dealt shit cards. Uh, <sighs> the player to your oh, left, so me. Austin, is figuratively on fire <laughs> and, literally. Not that and literally. So I'm on fire, <laughs> and he throws bears. <laughs> <laughs> it's a pretty solid. Super versus awesome. a mafia don. That's six inches tall. <laughs> yes. But used to be a bear. <laughs> I can throw his ass. It says throw bears. It doesn't say what I can't throw. But he, he used to. He's not yeah, a bear. He's anymore. also only six inches tall. He's trans bear. Yeah, but he's like. <laughs> I can throw bears at him. Yeah, but well, he's but he used to be a bear. So he's just gonna be like, what up, bear homie? Yeah, well, I'm not a bear. I just throw bears. And he's a bear. But you're on fire. Oh, yeah, I'm also. So you on can't fire. last that long, also. Yeah, well, okay, I guess I'm just running at this six inch tall fucker and throwing him because he's a bear. Yeah. He's, to be a bear. He's, okay. I'll, 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 he's also six inches tall, I'm gonna step on him. I'll get, I'll, I'll You're also on fire, dude! Yeah, and I can last for a little bit. I mean, it doesn't say how far away we are when this battle starts. Yeah. If we're in the same room, I'm winning. Think about <laughs> like a die. Pokemon battle, like you. Oh, yeah, yeah I win. Right I'm gonna, okay, I'm so gonna think about like this. This guy used to be a bear. So you throw bears at him, <laughs> yeah. and then he's like, 
Well, it bear. Just say, says, and then he says, like, fuck that dude up in bear. Well, I was going to say, I was like, it just says throws bears. I don't think I can spawn bears. I think I just have the ability to lift up bears and throw them. So <laughs> <laughs> I don't think there's any nearby bears at all. So that ability doesn't even help yeah. in this situation. I'm just fighting a six inch tall, used to be a bear. Yeah. Mafia Don. <laughs> I'll put my money on you, Austin. Uh, yeah, I'm not, I'm I'll put my money on Mafia Don. I have faith in Why do you think it's going to win? Because six inches tall, he can just get away from you. He can go yeah. somewhere where you can't go, and you're just on not, fire. Not for, like, a well, battlefield. I was going to say, if he has well, nowhere to hide, no, though, there's, Austin but there's will crumple no, him. Well, I think it's, Nobody said it about anything about a battlefield. They, well, yeah, but then, giving us a, a well, then either argument can't go either way, because we could argue that if it's Maybe the Mafia Don can hide under a car and weep. That's what I'm saying. Really? And if he's a Mafia Don, he can just call fucking... He can just call the Mafia. No, he's so maybe he maybe Austin will throw a bear at this tall. guy and kill him, but then he'll call the mafia and Austin will eventually. Well, you're Are gonna you going to pretend a six inch tall mafia man's going to use a phone? <laughs> well, you maybe he has a six inch tall mafia phone. I, don't I mean, so. how how? Because it, he's, he's the fucking dawn, tall. dude. He's six inches tall. There's no way that he's Apple low. probably made him his own fucking his own special phone. Special I want to know how he went from a bear to a six inch tall mafia I can throw bears. Okay, I can definitely stomp out a six inch tall mafia dawn. Doesn't matter what his occupation used to be. Okay, six all I'm tall. saying is he all he needs to do is get far enough away from you to get underneath something, and you can't get. Dude, him. I'm a That's giant. You're, dude, okay, I, he just has to wait you out. Also, also on, yeah, him. but you're also on he fire. He has to wait you out. Yeah, but You'll that's gonna make me faster. I'm gonna have all that energy. I'm gonna be like, you're fucking for sure dying. Okay, but, but in a thirty second fight, you lose. There's no way. If, if you can get him in the first 30 seconds, you could win. Yeah. Exactly. Okay, but I'm just saying, if, if it's the biggest How would longer, he get away? He's six inches tall. I could take one step yeah, and beat okay. him. How does that make That's sense? That's true. Yeah. I'd be way quicker than Maybe that. he has super fucking fast speed. What's this Ant Man now? <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't have a suit on. He's a six inches tall. He doesn't have any special powers. He's right, just so now a it all depends on where you're at when the fight happens. So you clearly avoided for yourself. Well, yeah. Tony, you're voting for, dude, you're for the Mafia fire, dude. Yeah, but you gave me 30 fire. seconds. That's a lot of time to stop six I'll give you my, my vote as well. That's, say, yeah. Yeah. I That's unfortunate. Could, I think you could take fire. a six inch tall Mafia dog in 30 seconds. I think you're underestimating I have the, the panic of, throw bears. of being on fire. If a man can throw bears, he can survive a fire for 30 seconds. Mm -hmm. That's true. Superhuman fucking firepower, dude. All right. Next we have Bruce Lee. Oh, this one's already going to win. Writing a blank draw as you draw character. a character card. So Bruce Lee writing a Hulk. Oh, oh God, fuck. Oh, okay. There's okay. no way. With a stone gaze. Damn. Oh, he for sure. It's over. Fighting. Don't even draw. A queen. <laughs> you lose queen. That can run 200 miles an hour, but oh. only in a straight oh. line. That's an all right That ability. sprays neurotoxin. Whoa. Ooh, this is Scott. He's really got stone good. gaze, though. This is, yeah, it's true. And he's on a Hulk, like. But stone gaze, does he have to look him in the eye to turn to stone? I, or I assume just, that's how that works. Yeah, so if she's like, oh fuck, here comes Bruce Lee on a Hulk, I'm gonna run 200 yeah, miles it, an hour and spray a neurotoxin that yeah. the Hulk will be oh, chasing yeah, just, and being like, oh, I'm getting toxified. Yeah. Well, also, it's also Hulk. I mean, he could—he has a lot of strength. He could just jump. He could, away from I was gonna say he could probably jump just much further than she could. He could, could probably run. spin it away. Dude, no way. Well, two hundred miles an hour. Yeah, I guess that's not that. That's, that's like not that the fast. Hulk speed. Yeah, <laughs> like, he, he can, can, he he can, can jump pretty that. far. Um, yeah, I think. Well, I, I think too that if 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 we can assume that the Hulk is also that fast, that if he just can catch the Queen, even he's if not, the neurotoxin, there's no way he's that fast. He's he could. The first could get close, and then Bruce Lee could be like. And she just turns yeah, stone. Yeah, I was gonna say if, if they get caught, well, if she stops at all. I don't like think a stone stopped. gaze means that it turns you to stone. Does Isn't it? That yeah, what I'm pretty sure it's, it's, it's like a say? Medusa thing. I think. Oh, okay. I think it's like term for it. But how powerful are are these neurotoxins? Well, because like, yeah, like, how it's also strong whole, are we talking here? Like, yeah. I don't know how neurotoxins affect. Whole. Because okay, let's say the neurotoxins can kill Bruce Lee. Mm. Say that negates the stone gaze. So then we have a queen that can run 200 miles an hour in a straight line versus the Hulk. Carrying a dead Bruce Lee on him. Carrying a dead <laughs> Bruce Lee. So I would say the Hulk in that instance, obviously. He could catch her and just rip her apart. Are, but are we also allowing... The, well, yeah, the, she would still are we considering the fact that the possibly. queen has all the power in the constitutional monarchy? <laughs> <laughs> but also has a well, fucking... She have an army behind her? Yeah. Well, if we're doing that, then we should assume that the Hulk also has the Avengers with him. If we're pulling those right. No, the Hulk does shit by himself all the time. The queen doesn't go anywhere by herself. It's true. The Hulk, the, that, the Hulk lives in Brazil by himself. It just says queen. Like the, the, drag queen. Drag queen. Yeah. Like has a Freddie Mercury for the, <laughs> the lead singer of Queen. Because if there's five dudes out there running two and a half hour, that's a lot different than just one old lady. Yeah, Damn, dude. Yeah. This is kind of tough. Yeah, I'm going to give my money on Hulk. I'm going to say Hulk, too, just because... Yeah. I'm going to assume the Queen has the Queen's army with her. 
Do you that's want? a big assumption. Yeah, it's pretty it's big. The queen. That's a big the queen assumption. doesn't go. You've never seen the queen anywhere. But without, the Hulk okay. without some type of armor. But if the Hulk could take Hulk out the queen's army, all of fucking Britain, <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's gonna bring the Avengers. Yeah. Well, and the Hulk could easily take out. Yeah, I was like, it's the, the, the fucking Hulk. British army. Okay, but this is the thing: is the Hulk has gone places by himself. Mm -hmm. The Hulk doesn't want to be the Hulk. Well, even if the Avengers aren't there, Hulk could for sure take out. Are the we getting into like the Hulk's mentality right British now? Army. Like how he's how he's okay? I'm with just himself. trying to like think about this scenario as a whole. The uh, if it's Queen, the Queen, we'll assume it's a Queen. Yes. Mm -hmm. A queen or any like major politician, the president, whatever, never goes anywhere without like their. Well, yeah, but this is also guard. one on one. It's supposed to be a super fight between the the these circumstances. There's not supposed to be of any other additional information. I don't know. It's dude. just supposed to be. I'm gonna this. go with Hulk, even if her neurotoxins what are like fuck ever, fucking bro. terrible, and she kills Bruce Lee. I don't think Hulk can be. He could probably be hurt by neurotoxins. I don't think he would die though. Yeah, you don't and think. Then, I think you don't think a two hundred mile per hour old lady would kill the Hulk. The Hulk's fast oh, yeah. too, though. I feel like he could like. He's real fast. He's very fast. If he yeah. just like hit the ground and just shook her for a second, yeah. broke her hip because she's ninety. <laughs> right. And then Bruce Lee could spin kick her ass or something. <laughs> All, right, All right, you're up, bitch boy. You're up, boy. Oh shit. Okay, we got Girl Scout. Just one. <laughs> oh, Girl uh, Scout. That throws a ninja stars. Ooh, spooky. Um, armed with catarangs. Cat boomerangs, I'm assuming. Yeah. Was the, cat the least boomerangs. effective weapon. <laughs> like batarangs, but with a cat. Uh, okay, Fen Fatale with. Ha, has an invisible jet. Okay. And is radioactive. Like in a bad way? Um, definitely the It's kind of crazy that this person fatale. got two different types of, like. Throwing, throwing, throwing right? things. <laughs> yeah. Throwing does, she yeah. Have, does she have her throwing badge? <laughs> she will after this one. Oh, okay, okay, right. that's a different story. The catarang yeah. badge. Um, I think this is well. She has bad. an invisible she has a jet. jet yeah, she wins for like, real. You can't stop a jet with ninja. Stuff. But it's just an invisible, so you can just see her flying through the air. <laughs> like yeah, nothing it's else. It's like Wonder Woman. Yeah, she's like, yeah, it's like <laughs> yeah. there's a woman sitting and in the she's sky. She's really active. Like she can just drive the jet near her and just be like <laughs> sit there until she's like, ah, I'm You're being dying, poisoned. No. That's true. Yeah. Yeah, I think Femme Fatale just went. Sorry, sure. sorry, girls. I get girls killed scout, by no. non-invisible cars all the time <laughs> in PUBG. So yeah. right. If, if it was an invisible jet, I think. I'd yeah. Be super you usually fun. have guns in those scenarios. All she has is a catarang. Right. Just it's just like, radioactive. I don't think catarangs are gonna do much. Right. She's also a fucking girl scout. If it was a boy scout, <laughs> yeah. I mean, maybe. But oh, wow, <laughs> dude. All right, you're up. Just kidding, Girl Scouts of America. Go for it, boy. Keep those Samoans coming. Viking. A Viking. That can become any animal. Ooh, Shit, that's okay. fucking hardest. But he's made of paper. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but well, the paper well, shape. He's, he's paper shape against, bear. Okay, but okay, okay, if it's going up against fire, okay, he's yeah, fucked. Yeah, 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 let's get the other things before we argue. A hockey player. Oh, so you? That's me. Uh, with a angel sidekick. Fuck, that's hard to be. Damn. Damn. We have to choose what an angel. angel. Oops, no, no, you're sorry. Right. That's three stories tall. It's game over. Okay. Fuck, a three story tall yeah. angel. <laughs> so you're basically like one of the Winchesters who has a sports hobby. But he can become that's any also animal. Very tall. Yeah, but he's made of paper. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but that might help you. <laughs> he can be the most badass what animal. If, okay, think, paper, hear me fucked. out though. Hear me out. Yeah. What if he turns into like the most poisonous animal in the world, like a snake or something, and then turns into paper that's like super flat and just shimmies his way over to you? Because that'd be really hard to hit. Even if your angel's three stories tall. But he tall, is. But he's, he is made of paper. Yeah, he's made always, of paper. But I, but it's to assume that he can also turn into an animal still. No, no, it's also no, one no. of his abilities. He is. He's not like a piece of paper. He's a person that is made of paper. So he can either be a Viking, or. He's a animal made of paper. Yeah. So so he can become a, a venomous snake, but he's just paper. Yeah. Well, yeah, I think he's like, made of paper. I still, think, I still think he gets the ability <laughs> right, of that yeah. thing, though. Oh, but you're saying the piercing of it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. yeah it's yeah. paper. Yeah, yeah, he loses. <laughs> yeah, definitely the hockey play with the he's fucking... He's an angel! With the fucking <laughs> angel! <laughs> three stories tall. It's three Fuck, stories yeah, tall, yeah, for sorry, sure. Sorry, yeah, That's unfortunate. You had it. You had it was it good until the paper. We could have justified it, but the paper thing really throws the whole whole situation. Sorry about the paper. Top row keeps getting fucked. All right. Next up, we have a woolly mammoth okay. that throws burritos. Oh hell yeah, dude! And has telekinesis. Fuck. So he well, can he can read minds shit. and right. That's what that is. No, yeah. Or no, control yeah, you shit with your mind. Yeah. yeah. Versus a dolphin. That's on a Segway. <laughs> that shoots acid. <laughs> it's also gasping for air. All right. Um, so the the mammoth that throws burritos and controls shit with his mind versus the dolphin. So I think it's pretty dolphin. obvious to say that the dolphin loses, right? Why? Because he's on a Segway. But he <laughs> shoots acid. That? Is that he's a dolphin? So what? Dolphins are mammals. They breathe air. And they're fast, so he can throw but shit with his mind. He doesn't have mind. any arms. He's just on a Segway. Dude, 
Dolphins can rape people. Yeah, you know, you've seen a dolphin. Yeah, I know, and that doesn't mean they have sharp know, teeth. But they all, yeah, they rape people. But when they're like on docks and shit, they're still like near the water where they can manipulate that. But if it's just a dolphin out of land on a Segway that shoots at, it would just be like, "Come at me, fucker! Like I'm gonna take you out." Maybe it's a Segway. I mean, that's, ability, and he has telekinesis. He's not but he's a mirror. woolly mammoth. Is he smart enough to he, know how to use his telekinesis? I, well, I'm pretty sure if he gets into attack mode, and the dolphin starts right. shooting acid. Well, here's at him. the big thing: one of these is extinct, and the other one is not. Oh yeah. Okay, true. we said that at the beginning. That it's we a zombified holy mammoth. We were saying at the beginning we weren't going to do that. We're going to do what? Well, because we got like Helen Keller. We're like, well, she's a sorry. She doesn't live. No. So we, you would just. She lose. doesn't live. <laughs> she don't live no more. She would just lose. All right, fair enough. Uh, um, yeah, I was going to say it's hard to just to say if the holy mammoth would know to use telekinesis. I mean, the burrito ability is pretty dumb. That's not helping. No, no. that does nothing. You're just, and you're you're feeding, maybe the it's distracting the dolphin. You're feeding the dolphin, and then he's going to just shoot more acid. Because yeah, like if, you have, if you have telekinesis, though, like, couldn't you just stop the acid shots? Yeah, you could stop. You could win. That's you could, you could just take him true, off. Yeah. Or if you just take the segue away. So if we assume that the woolly mammoth can you know that he's going by his tail. Yeah, just like, <laughs> I win. Yeah. If we assume that the woolly mammoth is conscious enough to fight the dolphin, the woolly mammoth wins for sure. Yeah. Yeah, I think well that we'd have to give the same thing to the dolphin, like if that he knows yeah. how to use a Segway or sh- or how to shoot the acid. Yeah, even if he knows, let's just assume they do. He can't really operate it still. Even I if think he knows the woolly how to mammoth wins yeah. though. Yeah, woolly mammoth much bigger too. I agree on that one. Woolly mammoth are big, <laughs> for sure. Woolly mama. All right, Stinius. Woolly mama. We got Apache warrior uh, with horrible self esteem. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, there's one hundred of them. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> if you're in a hot topic, uh, there's a hobo, and he's, he has vertigo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Mega fighter. Uh, left leg. Oh, my is, God. Oh, my goodness. He becomes Voltron. Hold on. So his left leg is now Hillary Clinton. No, left leg. His right leg is now my ex. <laughs> uh <laughs> My left arm is an E.T., and his right arm is the Statue of the Liberty. Damn. He's fucked. This is unproportioned as fuck. For real, dude. It's an entire statue. No wonder he has Hillary vertigo. Clinton. Dude, but the Apaches have such low self-esteem. Yeah, but he's being held up by all of that darkness. That's true. Hillary, Hillary Clinton. Clinton. Yeah, Hillary Clinton. Liberty. You already lose. E.T. Um, There's a hundred of them, And he, he has vertigo, though. too, so he probably couldn't even stand up. Yeah, right, yeah exactly. it's a huge one, yeah. So you, we have to assume that but the But the Apaches have right? horrible self-esteem. What? There's a hundred of them. Yeah, what if they're like, they're all right, well, we can take him. Well, what, what if we can't? Yeah, there's a yeah right? Like, what if we can't? Oh, what if, God, oh right. he's right. What if we can't do it? I don't know. Here, we should do it like this, because it's like, this puts a better perspective. So the hundred Apache warriors with horrible self-esteem. Versus a hobo. Made up of E.T., Hillary, an X, and the Statue of Liberty that has vertigo. Made of vertigo. He seems pretty useless, to Maybe. be honest. <laughs> I like how you made it. Like it. Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, if if he can control his body, even if he's got two people for legs, uh, he could smash him with the Statue of Liberty, I guess. But that's. But he would probably he miss a lot because he's like. Or if he can even if, lift it up. If, I mean, because they're not really saying that you can. Yeah, but Hillary Clinton could have anyone killed. <laughs> well, but also, like, I feel like if, if my ex and Hillary Clinton are down at the bottom holding up this whole thing, uh-huh. and the Statue of Liberty is raised, they get squished. <laughs> yeah. The weight of liberty. Or, right, yeah. But what if? Well, this what has what to be he, he can phone him. home. Yeah, can he? Can, can he even lift the statue? Like, is this a super powered hobo? Well, we have he's a mega fighter. Yeah, he's, he's a mega fighter. So we're assuming okay. that he can. Okay, so he this can is function, all okay. Yeah, that it's not just going to be like physics, and then they all die. Gotcha. Yeah. So if he can lift, if he can use the statue, statue of Liberty, but he, then he could for sure. If he has E.T. for a left, a left arm, he's gonna have the fucking army after him the entire time. So he's gonna be trying to evade the army. He'll also have Elliot though. Yeah. <laughs> and it's, it's well, yeah, but that's got a hobo, <laughs> hobo at top who has vertigo. He's like, oh, <laughs> yeah, right, yeah. wait, hold on. I feel like the hobo getting attacked by these fall and smash all the pets. Right, you right. get attacked by these hundred, like, oh, with I, you. I, I just feel like the fact that he has a mobile Statue of Liberty on his arm yeah. makes it so he would probably win. Because even if he got swipe. scared, yeah, just like, oh, bo, bo, bo. they're all gone. Yeah, it's unless like, one oh. not so. Badly self-esteemed warrior could get to his yeah, head. Because I was gonna say, because you could still have you could have bad self-esteem and still be a good warrior. Sure, yeah, yeah. But he's also got Statue of Liberty, and that's hard to fight against. This guy has a lot of fucking problems, though. Yeah, he's, he's got three complaining things, and then the Statue of Liberty. Yeah, and Vertigo. And what if he's too out of his mind to even know how to use the Statue of that's Liberty true. properly? Is he a druggy hobo, or is he just a unfortunate, inc- hobo. unfortunate hobo? You know. I, okay. 
to assume that they're all just gonna fight, I, I'm gonna vote for Hobo. I would say Hobo as well. Yeah, I think it's Hobo. Especially because yeah, these guys the are probably just like, I don't know if we can do it. Yeah, yeah. And, and by the time they choose, he's just like, he's the arm. He just accidentally death. falls on them. Yeah. yeah, exactly. And Hillary Clinton calls in whoever she calls in to kill people and has them all killed. So. Oh, yeah. Sorry about it, Democrats. Sorry we had to do this. Sorry about it, dear McCurtains. Dear McCurtains. A mummy. <gasps> Throws fireballs. That's a good move. Controls magnetism. Okay. It's pretty good. That's pretty sweet. Versus, Versus saber tooth tiger, armed with a portal gun. Ooh. That can see three seconds into the future. Game over. Uh, so if the mummy, so we're doing the conscious thing, right? To see yeah, yeah, yeah. Knows how to for do sure. It. So if a mummy throws a fireball, he can see three seconds in the future yeah. at all times. So he knows how that, to counteract that move the mummy right at all there, times. Just like, and you could just make a portal and it just like put a portal in front of the fireball, and then one other one behind the mummy okay. and shoots like, the mummy. And he's made out of like he's got a bunch of paper and shit. This right. card here can see three seconds into the future. That yeah. that does everything. Mm -hmm. Oh, but he controls like, magnetism, so he could. Oh, he but he could see three seconds in the future. Exactly. So he just knows exactly what he's going to do. Well, even if he knew that though, could he stop it? And sure. he controls magnetism. How would he stop that? He'd just be like, "Come well, to me." He's like a portal he's a tiger. tiger or something. Well, yeah, but he could just take, take vanish the gun away. away. He's a he's a fast tiger. He can be like, Whoosh. "Yeah, but if he controls magnetism, he can literally well, okay, just, regardless of where he's." He could also just be like, "Okay, so I, I can see that you're gonna try to take my portal gun, so I'm just gonna fucking charge your ass, and maybe he gets hit with a fireball, but he." Could take the but he could see where he's gonna throw the fireball, mm -hmm. so he could evade the That's fireball, and then is. claw him right in the fucking face, rip off his fucking you know outfit, yeah. his mummy outfit, and then he's he's dead. Yeah, but he's already dead. He's a mummy. He yeah, have eternal parts, and if he gets close enough, then he can still do his business. Do you know what else? What mummies are afraid of cats. That's true. Oh, you're right. Super That's afraid true. Of cats. Thing. That's I'm gonna have point. to go with the I'll fucking cats, tiger. All the way. fucking psychic tiger, dude. Sorry about it. Yeah. 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 All right. Close though. <laughs> Mummies <laughs> are afraid of Close, cats. dude. Yeah, remember the mummy? Foolish of us, yeah. When he fucking... Anubis? He's all, hey! And he showed him yeah. the cat. Like, oh, and, no. and that was a house cat, not a saber-toothed right. tiger. Like, imagine right, the difference. Last one? Yeah, okay. So we have an assassin that is riding a battle cat. Damn. And that lays exploding eggs. <laughs> versus a boy scout. <laughs> boy scout, <laughs> dude. Wearing skis. <laughs> oh, no. And there's there's ten of them. <laughs> it's like oh, it's ten like skiing, slipping everywhere. Skiing boy scouts. <laughs> I think this was pretty assassins. Easy. We should do another one because assassins win for sure. Well, yeah, obviously the exploding eggs. Will... You can't really. All right, well, this kind of a battle cat too. And he's an assassin. There's untrained boy scouts <laughs> that are on skis. It's like wait, oh hold God. on. Did, did the fight we're gonna do another one. I have to take a shit. Me. How was your shit? Shitty. Okay. It Last hurts. one, boys. Last one. So we got the Coachella lineup. Oh shit! All of it? The whole lineup. That's a yeah, lot this of is people. This gonna be hard. Who's playing Coachella? Mm. Uh, but they can't turn left. <laughs> 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 and also has a beard made of bees. Damn. Ooh. That's a lot of beards. That sounds bad bees. for them. Yeah. How's that good for them? They'll have bees, bee beards. We'll, we'll, assume, we'll assume the bees are allies. Of them. Okay. Well, I don't think they can use them. They're just a fashion statement. It's loud and annoying. Yeah. Uh, oh, versus Iron Man? <sighs> Shit. Okay. And he's made of mirrors. <laughs> oh. Uh, literally wearing beer goggles. Fuck. So he's Iron That's Man. That's tough, he's dude. He's a weak Iron Man. Yeah, he's made, he's fragile. He can't so, focus. But he, he can still shoot his shit, right? But he's just fragile. Yeah. Can you imagine being made of, made of mirrors, though, too? You're so reflective and, like, like, nobody would be able to hit you, probably. They'd be like, where the but fuck is he? But what the fuck is the Coachella line I'm going to do to Iron Man? That's a, I, I, Not that much. I just think that Iron Man's going to have to murder a lot of people. <laughs> probably. To, yeah, to he's hit gonna, the right people. But he'll still win. I think so, too. Yeah, I think he has those little... Ing. Yeah, he's just, Ing. he's just like a blinding like ball in the sky. Yeah. Like, what the fuck is that? Like, woo, woo. Yeah, yeah, if you look at it, you're probably seeing a reflection from the sun. Or yeah, something. you're just like, I don't even know what shooting has. Yeah, and all your bees are getting all flustered. Right. Yeah, I think Iron yeah, Man. If the be if the beard of bees is not on your side, mm -hmm. like you well, gotta, what are like, the fucking bees gonna, gonna do to Iron Man? They're gonna, gonna do yeah. shit to Iron yeah, Man. Yeah. They can't even bees get can't in. hurt mirrors. Yeah. And they can't turn left, so they can't really They're run They're just going to run into themselves and knock yeah, themselves like, out. Run, run, if, if he just make, if he sh like just shoots like this direction, like they they can't run this way. Yeah. So they're like, ah, I guess just we're just to keep making circles. Yeah, just sure. running around in circles. It's like, cool. <laughs> yeah, Iron Man for but sure. But if he goes the other way, he just will stop them and win. There's probably some hard-ass sure. people playing Coachella, though. 
but it's to Iron be Man. fair, we haven't looked at the Coachella lineup. That's I don't true. think the humans fighting <laughs> Iron Man matter how many there are. Dude, he's wearing beer goggles. He can't see. Who is Iron Man facing? The weekend? Yeah, Iron Man wins every time. Jamiroquai, dude. Beyonce? Yeah, Iron Man wins every time. Dude, Tyler Creator, though, and Posty. Posty has a lot of guns, dude. <laughs> it's true. Damn, he's just so hard um, to shoot, man. That's true. Yeah, guns aren't going to do shit to Iron Man. You need some, like, hardcore weaponry for Iron Man. Well, I feel, I feel like that it, since he's made of mirrors, he can shatter easy, but he'd just be hard to hit because he's made of a translucent thing, essentially, or right. a reflective thing. Sorry. But at Coachella, are these people are these people at Coachella? So they're not going to have all their no, guns. Oh, well, yeah, it's just the Coachella lineup. Like, So I think it's like everyone well, headlining Coachella is just going to walk out. Or is it is like Iron Man shows up at Coachella and then the lineup starts fighting him? We should probably decide it, which but, one of those So is. Tony Stark is Iron Man, but is he in the Iron Man suit? Well, it says Iron Man and not Tony Stark, so I would assume yes. Yeah, but he is Iron Man. It's Mirror Man, actually. <laughs> yeah, he's in the he's in the Iron Man suit that's just made of mirrors. Iron Man is just the suit, yeah. It's like and if he's made of Man. mirrors, how are you even gonna see him? That's what I'm saying. He's just reflected. You're just gonna be like, what am I shooting at? Yeah, exactly. No one's gonna have a clue blinding. where the fuck he is. He's gonna be in the sky and he's gonna be like shooting random shit because he has beer goggles what if, on. And, what if, and none of them can turn dude, left. Like they lose. Like they, they, <laughs> yeah. He just has to shoot missiles at them and they like. What if they made like a fucking power band and played like a really cool song and just like persuaded them? Yeah. And it was like. <laughs> <laughs> like so it was like a show me no. what you got. Type of scenario. No. <laughs> Show me what you got. No. And they did no. get swifty, and then Iron Man is out for blood, dude. He's he's in a mirror. Yeah, Iron Man he showed up to Coachella wearing literal beer goggles. He's there to fucking kill. Yeah, I'm gonna go Iron Man. Sorry, Posty, yeah. but I think you lose this one. A lot of bees. So yeah. <laughs> and the bees too. Yeah, like, like as soon as they're starting getting mayhem, the bee beards are gonna like start. Yeah, they're gonna start stinging it. everybody. It's gonna be like game over. Yeah, dude. I think I. It's hard to. It's hard to. I think Iron Man wins this one. Iron Man wins this one. Sorry. Sorry. Two bits. Spider-Man wasn't playing. Okay. Alright. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Thank you for watching. Uh, the game is called Super Fight. If you like it, you can fucking go find it. Play it for yourself at your own expense. Do it. Have a good time. And also war robots, too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, gonna take a quick second. I'm saying, I'm saying, saying this meme has to come full circle when you actually get us an ad for war robots on this channel. Come on, war robots. We'll sponsor you. Break a million subs. Yeah, tell Tony. Be like, yo, Tony, hey, get the Dinky Dine subs, Show. A million subs or more, we'll get it. Get the Dinky Dine Show war robots saying, ad. Dude. I want to talk to you about war robots for a second here. Yeah. Thanks so for watching, weird. guys. We'll see you in the next video. Be sure to check out our links in the description. And yeah, bye. love you all. Bye. Be sure to subscribe to the Tony's Tony's non-recurring series. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, bro. <laughs>